Well, two sisters separated before they had time to build memories are finally getting a chance to do just that. And through many twists of fate and years of searching, a gap of 53 years came to a close. Liliana Pearson with the story. <laughs> the way 53-year-old Bev Boro and 73-year-old Doris Crippen look at each other, you might think they're sisters catching up. <laughs> and that's what they're doing. They only have 53 years' worth of stories to share. We hugged each other and we just both was overwhelmed because our search is over. We don't have to look anymore. They're among five siblings, all separated more than 50 years ago. Bev, only six months old at the time. I've missed out on her life and she's missed out on mine. So, how did it happen? The sisters say it's God's work. Doris was recovering in the hospital from COVID-19 and a broken arm. As she was starting to improve, she was transferred from Omaha, where she lives, to Fremont, where a hospital had room for her. Bev, who works as a medication aide, saw her name on the patient list. It was the name her mother had told her about years ago. And I'd said to her, is your father Wendell Huffman? She goes, that's my daddy. And I pointed at myself, knowing she's hard of hearing, and going, that's mine too. And I nearly fell out of the chair and I just burst it into tears. It was just a happy feeling to find my sister. The last time Doris saw Bev, she could hold her. And while there's no substitute for time lost, they're excited for what comes next. And it was the Lord's blessing that I got sent here, people. Because if I wasn't sent here, I'd have never still found her and none of the rest of my brothers and sisters. Quite a story, uh, joy, uh, tears of joy. Bev has been able to introduce Doris to their other siblings. She also found them, and they tell us that Doris is looking forward to a family reunion once she's out of the hospital, chance to meet her siblings and extended family that she never knew existed.